I'm Billy Joe with Medical Service Company. I'm a respiratory therapist, and today I'm here to show you a couple of different oxygen tanks and how to connect the gauges to them. This is an E tank, this is a D, and this is a home fill tank. You might get different size tanks in your home depending on what you need and what your doctor has ordered. They're all going to do the same thing. They're all filled with oxygen, and all of the gauges actually go on top exactly the same. And then you can see on the table here in front of them, we've got a few different oxygen gauges. So they go on exactly the same. They work exactly the same. And you can see inside of them, you've got three prongs and a little knob that screws. And then you've got a gauge. This gauge will tell you how much oxygen's in your tank. You can see up here if it's full, down here in the red it would be empty. And then right inside here, I don't know if you can zoom in on that, there's a little washer. This washer tends to come off or it will crack. So if you don't have this washer, you're going to need one. And it just pushes down right inside on this prong that sticks out. And then once you've got your gauge and it's all ready to use, you're going to take your tank and on your tank you should have three holes on one side and one hole on another side. So you just want to line this up so that you can take your gauge. You slide it right over the top. You line up your three holes with your three prongs and then you just twist the handle and you keep turning it until it's tight. And then once it's tight and snug, the gauge is on your tank. Now you'll notice on the top here you've got a little toggle switch. So with this you can actually use this to turn your tank on. Some tanks do not have this toggle and you'd have to use an O2 key. You can see that on this tank here. This does not have a toggle so you would actually put this key on top. Then once you've got your gauge on the tank completely, you'll take the toggle and you'll turn it. I usually recommend that you turn it about halfway. You can see the needle pop up on your gauge so that it's full. And then you can turn the handle on the side and you can turn it to your leader flow and set it on the number that your doctor ordered for you to use. And then you would connect your oxygen tubing down here and this would be all set and ready to go for you to use your oxygen via your tank. When you go to turn it off, Take this toggle, turn it halfway back the other direction, and then your tank would be closed and you could take your gauge off. I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, please feel free to call Medical Service Company or your respiratory therapist at 1-800-824-1400. Again, that number is 1-800-824-1400.